President Trump noticing tweeting this morning this. So interesting. To see progressive Democrat congresswomen who originally came from countries whose governments are a complete and total catastrophe, the worst, most corrupt and inept anywhere in the world, if they even have a functioning government at all, now loudly and viciously telling the people of the United States, the greatest and most powerful nation on earth, how our government is to be run. Why don't they go back and help fix the totally broken and crime infested places from which they came? Then come back and show us how it is done. These places need your help badly. You can't leave fast <laughs> enough. I'm sure that Nancy Pelosi would be very happy to quickly work out free travel <laughs> arrangements. This tweet that you're just seeing now oh. is clearly going to get, I think, a lot of discussion. Comedian in Someone's chief. feeling very comedic today. Yeah. I, I, <laughs> one thing I was, I was at, uh, I call the squad the Instagram group, the hashtag squad goals and all that. It seems like a number of the things that they say are those memes that you see on, mm-hmm. on Instagram, these somewhat like defiant and inspirational memes. This is real life. Mm -hmm. This isn't uh, social media just having fun trying to, you know, rile people up. This is real life. The words you say have real life consequences. And I think that needs to be taken into consideration. I think President Trump is making an important point because he's trying to say that the values that built this country, everything from, you know, securing the border and being a nation of laws to, you know, freedom of speech on college campuses, whatever issue you're talking about, a lot of times these are the very issues that the left is trying to obstruct. And he's drawing attention to that and saying, if you don't like what this country stands for, you're not going to change it and take away all these things that Americans value so much. Like, if you don't like it, leave and go set up camp somewhere else. But you're not going to destroy what we have fought so hard and so long to value. It's a good point. It's a good point.